Hey guys, Emily from Foodbox HQ here. Today we're talking about Tavala, specifically their new smart oven air fryer. But before we start talking about that, let's get it out of the box. All right, so now that we've gotten our Tavala out of our box, let's talk about how you set it up. So you're gonna have a lot of different pieces. There's a little piece that goes in underneath here. It's just a little tray, just slides right in. Then on the inside, you'll see that we have a air fryer basket a drip tray, as well as that baking rack. There's gonna be some plastic and some stuff inside there. Make sure you pull all of that out. And then the first thing you're actually gonna do is download the Tavala app. Essentially, you're gonna pop into your settings and you can go into oven and set up a new oven. So it'll just ask you some questions about your Wi-Fi, And then from there, a couple of things will pop up here. Just follow those instructions. It'll get it all set up. First thing you're gonna do before you cook anything is you need to clean your oven. And the way you're gonna do that is you're gonna bake at 450 for about 20 minutes. That's just gonna sanitize everything inside so that everything is nice and clean. You might smell a little bit of burning while that happens. That's totally normal. They said to completely expect it. Now let's talk about the oven itself. So as we said, this is the Smart Oven Air Fryer. Tavala also has a Smart Oven Pro, which is a little bit different. We have done a full review of that. So if you wanna check that out, definitely check for the link in the description of this video. But the main difference between the two is that your air fryer is focused a little bit more on crispiness and your Smart Oven Pro has what's called a steam oven function. So you can technically air fry as part of the Smart Oven Pro. However, this one is gonna have the max air fry option. So it's gonna be a a little bit crispier. So as you can see, it's about the size of a microwave, fits right on your countertop here, and it's really versatile. So it has a lot of different options here. You have obviously the bake setting, as we mentioned, you could bake cookies, you could do a rotisserie chicken. They have broil options. You can reheat your food. They have a toast option. And then lastly, there's the air fry, which is obviously what we're talking about today. There's a couple of different ways you can use your Tavala oven and ways that you can actually get different types of food. They have a a pre-prepped meal delivery service. So they'll send you all of the ingredients ready to go. They'll have little recipe cards that you can just scan using this right here. So that's a little QR code scanner. That'll scan it and tell all of the information to the oven itself and it'll just cook it perfectly for you. Or you can buy pre-made meals at a grocery store, things like let's say a DiGiorno pizza. Scan that barcode right there and it'll know exactly how to cook it. So they partner with a lot of different brands. Definitely check their website to see if it matches, but it's a pretty cool option. Third option is you can make your own recipe. So if you take a look in the app, there are quite a lot of recipes there to give you some inspiration if you don't necessarily know what to do. So you've got that groceries thing that we were talking about. You can order, you can go into cooking. There's a lot of different recipes, but you can also make your own. So that's what we're doing today. So we're going to do a couple of different air fryer things. We've prepped some Brussels sprouts. So I have those right here. So we just chopped them up, tossed them in a little bit of olive oil, salt, and pepper, and they're ready to go. So if we want to cook them, what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at our app. You can create a new recipe. We've already created the air fryer at Brussels sprouts here, but we can create a new one. You just pop in, you select the step. So you just select the temperature. For this, we're going to do 375 right there for how long five minutes we're actually going to do it for 10 minutes but we'll do it in five minute increments so just so we can toss them in between and then you just hit done and that'll save it for you and then you just have one that you can grab at any time making it nice and easy all right so we're going to use our tavala oven mitt we're going to open this up take out that air fryer tray and i'm just going to toss my brussels sprouts in here so you want them in one layer might be a little bit crowded, but I'll just use my fingers, kind of flatten those out a little bit. So one thing you'll wanna do when you're air frying is this black tray here, you'll want that underneath just in case it's gonna drip, just so that you don't make any mess. It's just a little bit of an easier cleanup. So then we're gonna to toss this in here. If I can slide that in, perfect. Then I can open up my app again. Just hit air fryer Brussels sprouts, hit cook. It's set up to go and I just hit start.
All right, now it's time for a taste test. Let's get this sandwich. I'm so excited. Mmm. Wow. The chicken is so juicy. That's delicious. I mean, toast is toasted perfectly as well. Not even close to dry. That's really delicious. All right, let's get these Brussels sprouts. You're gonna have to excuse my fingers. We're just gonna eat them like finger food. Mmm. Really good. Definitely cooked, but probably could have taken a little bit longer in there to make them a little bit crispier, but still delicious. So a lot of flavor. All right, I'm gonna go finish eating this. I'll see you in a little bit for some final thoughts. All right, so just a quick wrap up on Tavala. We've reviewed these guys before with their second generation, also known as their Smart Pro. I think it's so cool how integrated they are with apps, as well as the QR code scanning and the barcode scanning. It really feels like you're eating the food of the future. Plus, I feel like in recent years, there's been a lot of conversation about new kitchen appliances, things like air fryers, but also things like pressure cookers and you know slow cookers. There's all of these different things, but every time I hear about them, all I can think about is where the heck am I gonna put that in my kitchen. This is really cool because it serves multiple purposes. You can use it as an oven, you can use it as a toaster oven, you can use it as a convection oven, as an air fryer. There's so many different ways to use it. I will say it doesn't completely replace your microwave. You know, there are some things that you still need to use that for, but it really does cover quite a lot. When you first get started with this, I definitely recommend sticking to the recipes that they have on the Tavala website or within the app, only because I think it's a little bit different than maybe some other air fryers out there. We used a recipe just that I looked up on the internet that said to air fry those Brussels sprouts for about five to 10 minutes. We did them for about 15, but I think they could have gone a little bit longer. So I think it's just a little bit different. So just as you get started, stick to their guides, use those sort of as a starting point and then pivot and sort of learn how your machine works from there. However, if you really don't like it, the only thing you have to do is return it. They have a 100 day return policy, no questions asked, as well as a one year warranty. We've obviously done a separate review on the Smart Oven Pro. They say you don't need to get an entirely new oven if you're just looking for the air fryer options. That Smart Oven Pro does do air frying. The one thing you'll wanna do is just to go on their site and get that uh, air fryer tray. So that basket that we put in there. It may not be as crispy as this because this has the air fryer max setting, but you're gonna be able to do it just the same, just might take a little bit longer. Overall, I think the last test here really is how the food came out. I haven't cooked anything in an air fryer before, but I was really impressed with the way that that chicken came out. It was so juicy, just really kept a lot of flavor and it really didn't take a lot of time. So if you're looking for a really cool air fryer slash smart oven, click the link below and check out Tavala.